another royal party to attend. I wish I didn't have to go to each and every one. Besides, it's my eldest half-brother Gregory who is the crown prince, not I. Frederick is second in line, Anthony is third in line, Sandler is fourth in line, and I know I'll never be queen of this land. But I know that already. But King Father wants me to peruse through any suitor or guest to see which one he can marry me off to. People already look at me poorly because I'm not a full-blooded daughter, and I'm just tired of it all. <sighs> deep breaths, deep breaths. <sighs> all right, Benda, I'm ready to face them. Okay, Benda, chin up, smiles on. Hello, hello, good evening, good evening, my lords and ladies. Oh no, it's not them. Good evening, my lord Orlan and Lady Burley. Yes, yes, it's always a pleasure to see you as guests in my, I mean my father's castle. Hmm? Am I excited to see the crown prince receive the throne? Oh, of course. I'm excited for Prince Gregory to eventually ascend into his reign. I think he'll do a great job as the seasons move forward. Hmm? What do I mean by, I think he'll do a great job? I mean that with time, he'll learn to be a wise ruler. Just because he's almost going to sit on the throne doesn't mean he knows everything. Uh, no. I'm not stepping out of line or speaking ill of our future king. We're having an open dialogue conversation. Please do not put words in my mouth, Lord and Lady Victor. You ask for my opinion, and I've given it. I know how you both look at me in the eyes of the court. I may be a half-blood, but I am more than you both will ever see. So, please enjoy the wine. And enjoy your evening. Oh, I need some fresh air. Huh, I shouldn't have left my room tonight. This is a total disaster. It's hard already trying to be a noble. Uh, huh? Who are you? Are you another illustrious guest of our deceptive noble court? <laughs> you came to check on a hapless lady. Look, Sir Arthur, I'm not looking for a hero. I just need some fresh air. Hmm? You need fresh air too. Well, I'm not hogging the place. Come, sit. So, who are you? I asked for a second time. Oh, you're not from the Owldales? You sound more like you're from Jadlever. You're a solo guest of the court. Well, nice to meet you, I suppose. My name is Binda. I unfortunately am <laughs> Princess Binda of House Kemnamore, fifth in line for the throne. But it's nonsense. Oh, you already heard the rumors about my lowly birth? So, you already have a formed opinion about me. No, you want to get to know me. That's different. No one truly wants to get to know me, so it's refreshing. What's my story? <laughs> well, my mother was a commoner, but she was a knight from another neighboring kingdom. My father, as you know, is the king, but... He was a young man back then, a prince. They became close, but when the court heard news of their illicit relationship, things took a turn for the worse. My mother was never to see my father again. However, my father refused to give up on not having me in his life. Despite me being branded as a bastard child, my father defied the rules of his father and took me in. My mother passed from what I believe was a broken heart. I never got to know who she was, despite what I was told. But she was beautiful, and her eyes had shine like no other. 
as my father said. <laughs> oh. So, I was raised to be a part of the nobility. But, of course, I'm not a fan favorite. Gregory and Frederick don't like me, and they just call me a thing. Anthony and Sandler adore me, and I adore them back. I feel like they understood me and what it was like to be ignored and overlooked. So, here I am now. I'm 23 seasons old, and still I feel like I've, I still feel like I don't fit in at all. <laughs> I think I'm brave. <laughs> well, thank you. Well, thanks for sitting with me and... Wait a minute. What on earth is that noise? Need to get back to the party right now. Oh my gosh. It's a, it's a massacre. Where are my family? Wait. You know the way? Well, point me to the way, because I need to find them now. Their lives and my life are at stake. I think we're at a harm's way for now, but where are my brothers? Where's my father? Maybe we should go back and try to find them, but what do you mean my safety is paramount? Who are you? You're, you're a spy? Sent to protect me? At whose request? My father. I, I do not understand. It was a setup for myself and the entire court to be. Oh no. My father knew that it would happen tonight. And Gregory would act? Oh my gosh. If Frederick, Anthony, and Sandler are gone, my father is gone, then that means I'm the last princess of the family of Kemphermore. Am I okay? No. No, I'm not. But I won't let Gregory's treachery have the last laugh. I will. <laughs> 